Hi, I'm Dr. Deb, and this is Sahifa, April 23rd. And I am here with Dave Farmer, who is our Director of Activities and Athletics for the school, as well as senior athletes who are about to go into an incredible weekend because it is indeed the last MESAC season, and we are hosting track and field at the school. So behind us are some amazing banners, an incredibly festive festive place here. Mr. Farmer, tell us about it. Tell us about what this weekend has in store for us. Thank you, Dr. Welsh. This is an amazing weekend for the American School of Doha. This is our third season, and we have the opportunity and the privilege to host the MESAC Track and Field Championships. And as Dr. Welsh had mentioned, that we've had a lot of contributions from our, the Look Company as a sponsor to come in and prepare our field and have everything ready for our student athletes. At this time, I'd like to introduce some of our student athletes who will be participating in their last MESAC event. These men and women are individuals who have made a huge contribution to our school and are going to be missed very much. At this time, I'll turn it over to our student athletes just to say who they are. Hi, I'm Andy Condi, and uh, this weekend I'm competing in the 3,000 meter, 1,500 meter, 800 meter, 4x4, and the triple jump. Uh, MESAC has been such an incredible experience for me. It's given me so many opportunities to race and compete against other people. I've made so many friends from other schools, and it's just been um, an amazing opportunity to race and really um, kind of get that atmosphere of like an American high school still, where you still have your big meet every weekend and you get to compete against other schools, and it's a chance to just push yourself and really, really... Um, represent your school and all the hard work you've put in over the season and it's just it's just been a great experience for me. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Guslamalo and this weekend I'm going to be competing in the 200, the 400 meter and the 4x4. And I've only been uh to the American School for 2 years, but MESAC has represented um one of the best ex actually the best experience I've had at this school so far. It's made me meet a lot of people, and it's just so different from anything I experienced before when I was living in Canada, and I'm so grateful I got to be part of it. Hi, I'm Will Hoyseth, and I'm competing in the 4x4, 400 meter hurdles, 800, and then throwing discus and shop with this weekend. And this one's really special for me because this is my 15th and final MESAC. I've been doing it since 8th grade, and it's really been a large part of my life, and it's kind of defined my experience here at ASD. And so it's good to be able to come back and compete on our own home soil back in our own country for a last time and just kind of be there have a family around and see you and just kind of kind of sums it all up and makes it what it was and makes it important and meaningful so I'm just kind of thankful for the opportunity. Hi I'm Erica Lundstrom I've been to this school for three years and I will be competing with throwing so discus and shot put this weekend. MESAC is what I love the most about this school. I love doing sports, and it's a great chance to meet new people and to get the opportunity to travel to all these different places is amazing, so it's what I love. Hi, I'm Sylvia Fagali, and I'm competing in the 3,000 meter, the 1,500 meter, the 800, and the 4x4 this weekend. Um, MESAC has been an incredible experience for me. I really enjoyed getting to know every one of the teams that I've been on. This is my third year on the track team, and I also competed in cross country, so it's really awesome to see um, how these teams have developed, and I'm really excited to see how we do this weekend because we've been working really, really hard. Mr. Farmer, not only are these folks incredible athletes, but they're also terribly eloquent. Um, it makes us very proud to, to have you as our seniors. Thoughts as you think about um, this event that we are about to embark on? We're excited. I'm excited. But the, there's, there's the great thing of the opportunity, but then there's also the other side of these losing these, these special kids. You know, at the end of each year, we, our seniors graduate. These are the cornerstones of our programs. We, the contributions they made to our school are amazing. We owe you so much. We were, we're so grateful and so fortunate that individuals such as yourself were part of our program. You all, will, all of our seniors will be greatly missed. But it's, uh, as I said, it's going to be an exciting weekend, and I hope we do really well, and I wish the best for the kids. And so five international schools will be here with us. And we, um, from Dubai, from Abu Dhabi, from uh, Muscat, and from Delhi. 
So come on out and watch this incredible, incredible event. It starts tomorrow afternoon, Thursday, and it goes Friday and Saturday. It will go morning, um, then take a break in midday due to the heat and start again in the late afternoon. And um, we will be here, Booster Club will be here. Um, we'll all be having fun. Thank you so much. Thank you, Thank you so much. Thank you. Shall we do a little Misak cheer at the end? Yeah. 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 Yeah.